Rising temperatures combined with the first day of summer being just a month away means that boaters are out there hitting the water. The U.S. Coast Guard is urging people to be responsible, and today marks the start of National Safe Boating Week. Crown Forest Philippe de Gaulle explains what you need to know to ensure a safe trip. In order to prevent an emergency meet and greet with the U.S. Coast Guard and other first responders like this, the Maritime Agency is imploring boaters follow the laws before taking to the sea. You wouldn't drink and drive a car, so don't drink and drive a boat. The Coast Guard says alcohol use is the leading known contributing factor in deadly boating accidents, accounting for at least 18% of deaths. Always wear a life jacket. In 2020, the Coast Guard says 86% of drowning victims who died were not wearing a life jacket. Keep in mind, life jackets are required to be on all vessels, including kayaks, canoes, and paddle boards. And under federal law, life jackets have to be worn by anyone 13 years of age or younger. We like to live by the motto separate Pratis, and we found one of the best ways to avoid accidents is to be prepared before going out on the water. Petty Officer 2nd Class Dylan Steiny sharing that advice with the public during a safety event Saturday at Fort Baker in Sausalito. Check the Coast Guard websites and weather prior to getting underway. Um, dress adequately for the weather and, and prepare at the dock because as soon as as soon as those boats, um, they leave the dock, I mean, what's on the boat is on the boat. Take the vital steps to ensure what and who is on the boat returns with the boat. Philippe Jagal, Cron 4 News.